Hey guys, this is Arian from the Talking String channel, and today we have a brand new tutorial. This time it's going to be about developing on jailbroken devices such as iPhones and iPod Touches. So this is going to be a quick video, and you need to download this file from the link in the description. So once you have downloaded it, you just click on it and extract it, and open it up, drag all these folders to your desktop. So now that you have it on your desktop, as you can see here, we have one fol folder that's uh, it's actually a shell script. It's named Xco40 and Xco41. So 40 means uh, iOS 4.0 and 41 means iOS 4.1. So keep that in mind. Keep that in mind because you want to know which one to enter later. So go to utilities and then terminal once you opened it. CD desktop. Once you're on your desktop, you're gonna use a sudo command. So sudo uh, sh. And now this is the part that where iOS uh, versions come out. So 4.0. Um, uh, developing on 4.0. So I'm gonna go with 4.0. Xco 4.0. Dot sh. Password. Enter your password. Uh, it's doing this thing and yep, yeah, you're done. Lemon tea is done patching just restart Xcode and you'll be on your way So that's done and now one of the thing that it's missing right now is the iPhone patch this folder needs to be uh, manually replaced or actually copied to uh, Another folder so run this uh, sh shell script with Xcode and there is a, a directory right here you're gonna go to this directory and copy iPhone patch file right in there. So nothing else, don't change anything, don't open it up, just copy it there. And then you will end up with uh, let's just open up Xcode, create a new project, and as you can see, we got iPhone patched. It's basically the same thing with a iPhone OS application, but this is a user's template and iPhone patched. So Yep, thank you for watching this video and comment and subscribe and rate and stuff. Yeah, and happy developing. Thank you.